Hey everyone, I'm here today with a comparing video, this time between the Anniversary Edition Abbey Road Records. So, this will be a comparison video. Now, the original Abbey Road Record, which is the one on the left, um, I got that one for my birthday. The one on the right, which is the Anniversary Edition one, I got that for uh, Christmas. So, I'll compare them right now. And um, Anyways, right off the bat, these two are both similar, as you can see. Like, the background is similar. Uh... Like, it shows all four Beatles crossing a funeral procession. Or, and, uh, in the background, similar, uh, like, this one is what the album originally looked like. And then for the anniversary edition, this one is basically, um, another shot of Abbey Road in the photo use. Which the Beatles are walking the other way around. And then there's a bus, like, right behind them, like, coming toward them. So, yeah, so that's one major difference. Which, this is actually one of the photos they used when they were shooting it. And then, um... I actually just learned this in a video by, uh... The Holy Habs. I'm sorry if I pronounced your name wrong, but, um... In these albums, uh... There's actually a man standing in... Standing in the album, which... I believe it's... The people in the corner of the... By that car. There is a man that stands there. I don't know which one it is, because there's multiple people there. And then there's a car, which is a Beetle, and there's actually a Paul is Dead rumor clue. So, yeah. And another clue to the Paul is Dead rumor, which is obvious on this album, he has his eyes closed, walking barefooted while holding a cigarette. And pretty much all four Beatles members are dressed like they're at a funeral, which is another reference to Paul is Dead rumor. John Lennon is dressed up as a priest. Ringo Starr is dressed up as a undertaker. Paul McCartney is dressed up as a corpse, and George Harrison's dressed as a grave man. Basically a reference to the Paul's Dead rumor. And then the backs, of course, um, they're both the same, it's just the, the song listing is different. Like, this one has more songs on it, and this one has four sides, this one just has two sides. That one is one record, this one is two records in there, which I'll show in a minute. And then, um, there's more songs on this one, because... This one has the uh, recording sessions of each song. This one has the original songs. Like the original released ones. And that shows Abbey Road number 8. This one actually shows it fully. This one does not because there's an arm in the way where I'm pointing to. And then the records are kind of similar. I'll pull them out right now. This one, I'll tell you a fun fact, this one actually has two records stored in one sleeve. Like, it's not like a separate sleeve. And the packaging's the same for these ones. They're in black. And it has a full eaten apple on one side, or side one, I think. Side two is the half-eaten apple. This one shows both sides. You can clearly see the apple. This one does not show it on the other side. And I'm going to pull them out, so I'm going to set my camera down just so I can show you guys. The full records. Okay. Alright, so this is side one. And then that is side two right here. And now I'll pull out the other records. Which this time I can do it one handed. I've been trying I've been trying to do these one handed for each comparing video I do on the records. Sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's not easy. And then, um, let me see, which one's side one? Oh, yes. This one is side one. And then this is side two. And then the other record shows side three and side four. So I got side three right here, side four on the other side. Let me try to get this in one shot. There we go, got it. And like most of these records, they're all the same length, and most of them actually have an apple on it because that's the company that sponsors them. Alright, now I'm going to put these away because so I'm going to set my camera down. Bear with me, people, and I'll be right back. Just putting these back in the sleeves because records always come in sleeves when it comes to selling these things. Hmm. 
Alright, so, sorry about that, people. I'm just gonna get this, get these back in. Alright, I got the last record in, and that is about it. I hope you enjoyed this comparing video. Thank you for watching. Bye.